Hello, my Minecraft family. Welcome back to Simply Mindless. Uh, where I am running right now. Actually, I need to sprint. Why am I doing this? Well, because in the last episode, we ran into a drown with a trident. Yes, and he wound up impaling us. Um, actually, he did it twice. Once, and then uh, when I went back to go get my stuff. So right now he's kind of camping my gear, so I'm going to do what I need to do to get rid of him, which is to run 128 blocks away so he is guaranteed to despawn. And I'm going to circle back around and go get my stuff. Yes, because we don't want our stuff to get destroyed, especially now that we have a diamond pickaxe. So, happy Thursday! Yes, it's Thursday now. And hopefully I'll get my stuff back. And that drown should be gone now. Oh yeah, I forgot I got a turtle there. Okay, let's do it, let's do it. Please don't despawn. Please let my stuff be there. No, no, I mean I want the... Yeah, I want the trident throwing drown to despawn, just not my gear. And hopefully they can't equip it. I mean, it doesn't look like he's here, so that's good. Alright, my gear's still there. Oh yeah! Go, 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 go! Gotta collect it quick. No idea how much time's gone by. First thing I'm going for is my pickaxe. Yes. All right. Now we can get the rest of the gear. Just needed to make sure I secured my diamond. All right, all right. Let's grab everything, grab everything. So we did make some good progress on the mob farm. However, I ran out of materials. And as one of my subscribers and viewers commented, maybe try using netherrack because it's very quick to mine. And I think that's an awesome idea. So we're going to head back to the nether as soon as I finish collecting all my gear. And we're going to get ourselves some nether axe so we can uh, get back to work on this mob farm. This farm is going to produce so much goodness for us. We're not going to know what to do with it all. Right? Right. One thing I am certainly looking forward to uh, is an enchanted bow from this mob farm. It may take a little while to get it, but even if uh, even if I don't get it right away, I'm just even a regular bow, anything that I can use a range attack, because that is really what seems to knock me for a loop. Okay. This is, this, this really kind of not cool. Um, I re okay, so I didn't have my video recording again, and I really wanted to record it for this part. I, well, I want to record it for the whole thing, so now I feel pretty, pretty bummed. Um, so all the audio is there. Uh, I could kind of recreate what I did uh, to get my gear back. Um, I explained it so the trident throwing drown was over there. And I bolted out of my house and I ran all the way over there, which would be at least 128 blocks away. And then I circled back around and came back and got my stuff. I really wanted to show that. Not, uh, I can't believe I wasn't recording. Uh, I'm just too anxious to get this, this, this uh, gameplay going. I always forget to record. All right. Anyway. All right, got my stuff. Um, all the excitement of watching it is gone. I'm sorry about that. Um, okay, into the nether we go. I'm missing my helmet. Uh, can I go back and get that maybe? Uh, maybe I'll just craft it. No, nope, helmet's full. All right, well, I need gold. All right, now I'm all discombobulated. Man, it started off so good, now I'm all screwed up. Okay, let's go, let's go. Let's see if my helmet is over here somewhere. And then into the nether we go to collect some netherrack. Uh, helmet, helmet. Don't see it. Don't see the helmet. All right, I'm guessing the helmet is gone. All right, into the nether we go to get some netherrack. Uh, wait, no, I need gold, right? So, back. To go get those gold blocks so I can make some gold. Wow, what a bummer. Man, I am uh, so mad at myself for not hitting that dang record button. 
I think I need to create a checklist for myself and just have it on my screen. And then I can go through my pre-record checklist to make sure everything is going. All right, all right, all right. Let's uh, let's not get caught up on that. Let's uh, let's let's make some progress here. Alrighty. All right, in we go. Open, open the door. Collect my gold. And that is going to definitely be enough to make myself a helmet. Let's do a helmet. Oh, I did have my helmet. I just didn't equip it. Oh, well. Got myself a helmet, so I'm safe in the nether. And off we go. Back to the nether. I have a very bad taste in my mouth from them all the times I've gone to the nether. So this one better not make it worse. Oh, it's Thursday. I'm feeling it Thursday. Little Friday. It's Little Friday. Do, do, do. How come I'm not? I am swimming. All right, it just seems slow. All right, I hope you guys are all having a great day. I know I'm going to try to turn this into a great day, even though I forgot to record like the first two minutes. And see if I can get some actual progress done on this mob farm. Do, do, do. All right, nether racks. I have to go to my new nether portal, which is all the way behind my cows. Hello, cows. And they always say hi back. I love that. They always say hi back. Um, yeah, I was down there. No, I guess I don't really have an easy way down there, do I? Well, got to make an easy way down. I got to make one. I guess I put a little water down there, and then I could just jump down into the water. Or hay bale. I guess I could put a hay bale down there, too. Uh, nope. Still can't get down. There we go. Uh, down here. Jump on here. Jump over here. Take no damage. Good. In we go. Oh, boy. Back to the nether. Let's do it. Let's do it. Uh, right. Yep, right where I thought I'd be. And another rack. Let's just start digging. Take it from anywhere. Anywhere I could find it. Now, to finish this mob farm, I know I'm going to need probably, I don't know, maybe five, six stacks of materials. So, we'll be here a little bit. We are doo -doo -doo, five minutes. No, we're not five minutes. We are eight minutes in. Because I screwed up the first two minutes of recording. Alright, let's get all our nether rack. Actually, I found a uh, an actual use for nether rack. I know hardly anybody ever uses it in building because it just doesn't go with anything. It's just it's such a weird color and it just doesn't seem to work with anything. But the other day I was messing around and I mixed it with uh, deep slate, cobble deep slate, and man, does that look good together! So I want to see if I can put together a building at some point using netherrack and cobble deep slate. Just seems to really complement each other. So if it works out, then man, oh man, we have a need and a good use for netherrack. Unbelievable! Another awesome thing about deep slate. Helps another rack. All right, look at that. I got three stacks already. Thanks for the comment. Thanks for the comment on using nether rack. It is a lot quicker to mine. I don't know. Should I be mining it with probably iron? Let's burn up my iron pick. I think it mines just as quick. Ah, mines just as quick with an iron pick. I made a rhyme in no time. Ha, I'm a poet. Don't even know it. All right, I'll stop there because I don't know anymore. I don't know any more rhymes. Just stop. Mining netherrack. All right, where are we at? One, two, three, four. All right, maybe five, six. I uh, get. Whoop! Hey, there that goes. All right, so we go to here. Oh, 
Oh yeah. Today's a little Friday, so tomorrow is Friday. The rhythm of mining. Alright, let's grab one more. Alright, let's use this. Let's head back. Yeah, that was uh that was kinda painless. That was like uh two and a half minutes. I got like five stacks or something. So that's, uh, that's pretty good. Uh, gotta get back up, up to the top now. Back up to the top. How am I gonna get back up to the top? Um. All right, I guess I am. No, no, don't use my pickaxe to collect this stuff. That's not good. That's not good. We don't want to waste our pickaxe durability. Okay, now up, up. Up, up we go. Ah, I saw that bat flying around. Very interesting. I was trying to figure out how to, uh, how to, mi or not mine, but uh, farm bats. I didn't realize how tricky that was. It's actually very tricky to try to mine bats. All right, it is night. All right, uh, yep, we got creatures out. Creatures everywhere. Leave my cows alone. It's a good thing zombies don't go after cows. Like in uh, like The Walking Dead, you know, it's like they eat all the livestock. It's a good thing they don't do that in Minecraft. And you gotta figure out how to protect your cows from the zombies and all that mess. Alrighty, alrighty, let's do this. Let's get back. Jeez, oh, look at all those creepers. They just love that island. They just love that island. Look at them all. Look at all those creeps. The creeps, the bleeps, and the sweeps. Alright, so what do we got? What do we got? 12 minutes in, 12 and a half. So, three. It's got maybe three minutes. Three minutes to make some progress here. Yeah, these are the days, man, where I wish I, I actually did editing. Because then I could go back and recreate the footage for the beginning that I missed and get all that in there for you. But, but nope, it's the good, the bad, and the ugly. And today has got a little bit of ugliness in it. Oh, I love that trick. Oh, I love that trick. Oh, it's perfect. It's weird. If you don't realize you're going up, it almost looks like you're, you're walking flat. Like that weird perspective going on. Oh, this is a trek. Yep, we gotta get a water elevator in there. We got tons of kelp around, so it shouldn't be bad getting the water blocks. Just use the kelp and grow it all the way up to the top. Shouldn't be too bad. We got plenty and plenty and plenty of soul sand. Okay, now. Um, I gotta get back to the top of that. Oh, boy. Oh, boy, because I jumped. That's right, I jumped. Uh, do I have enough to get to the top? Do I have enough? Probably not, but we'll give it a shot. So we're going to go right here. So I need at least, what, 20-something to get to the top? Maybe a mix of cobblestone and gravel. We could do it. We can work our way to the tippy 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 top. Oh, so close. So close. All right. And that should do it. All right, we're back at the top. We're going to use netherrack. And where do we leave off here? And do, 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 here we go. Fill out the arms. These are going to be the water canals that the mobs are going to get pushed to the center with. They're going to be too high, but right now we're just going to start with one. And see, so we got one block there, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight, right? No, wait. Ah, I always forget if I start with one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so that's all the water. And then one on the end. Nine. There we go. And one up at the top. Okay, cool. And we do the other side. Just like so. Just like so. And come across. And fill in the sides. 
Yeah, good call with the netherrack, man. That is definitely a lot faster than mine. Okay, so we have all that. Now we have to go up one more level for all of these guys. So whoever gets pushed in doesn't have the ability to jump out. i do that. Do, 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 do. And we could skip those corners, save ourselves some materials. I don't think enough light leaks in if you leave the corners. If you leave the corners uh, without a block, I don't think light leaks in, but we'll, we'll find out, I guess. Whoops. And how are we doing on time? Oh, wow, we're way over on time. All right, sorry about that, guys. We're way over on time. Um, I still don't know what I'm going to do about that intro. Uh, boy. All right, well... We'll figure out that intro. Um, I might have to put some footage in like I did last time. Sorry about that, guys. But, uh, you know, things happen in these uncut series like this. So, see y'all tomorrow. Thanks for your support. And thank you for watching. Love you. Bye-bye.